I'm in my car and I'm headed to El Viejo San Juan or Old San Juan and I'm there for a day of walking around, eating, and I'm also going to be taking some pictures for my Instagram and I'm so excited to bring you with me and show you a little bit of Old San Juan. It is so beautiful and charming. It's the original city and I want you to see how beautiful Puerto Rico is. Let's go. Look at this view as we get to the Viejo San Juan. It's so pretty. This lawn headed to El Moro is such a family affair that happens. You come here and you fly your kite with your children. It's such a Puerto Rico thing to do. Check it out. The Castillo San Felipe del Moro is a beautiful and historic structure in San Juan. Castillo San Felipe del Moro gets its namesake from King Philip II of Spain. The fort is also referred to as El Moro here in San Juan. This large stone structure was designed to guard the entrance to the San Juan Bay. Tip number one, make sure you tie up your hair. For some reason, this area is so very windy. Check out my messy hair as I go along my trip. Once you enter El Moro, this is what you're gonna see. This is the first floor. Tip number two, make sure you have your comfy shoes on because there's lots and lots of walking. Here I am walking towards La Garita, which is the sentry where the soldiers would stand and look out to make sure nobody was coming, they were on guard. This is the upper level or the top part of El Moro and as you can see all of these openings were used for cannon. Here's some information about the three flags, the Puerto Rican, the Spanish and of course good old US. You can see the Atlantic Ocean, both sides of it. So scenic, so beautiful. I feel so tiny climbing this. Look at the soldier barracks. Here we find something that resembles where the soldiers would sleep. Done with our tour, let's head for a snack. Here we have piraguas. My husband chose this as his snack. In English, I guess it would be like a snow cone, but so traditional of Puerto Rican. Myself, I wanna have some coconut ice cream and that's what you'll see me grabbing. Of course, true to Puerto Rico personality, this guy's being so charming, flirty and funny as I pick out my ice cream flavor. Yum! Piragua and mantecado de coco. Yum! I'm focused on the job of eating my ice cream as I walk around. In Old San Juan, you will find great food, shopping, and museums. What I love about Old San Juan is its charming old world structure. I feel like I'm in a movie. Cathedral de San Juan, it was built in 1521. It's celebrating over 500 years of being here. Amongst all this old world charm, we also have some shopping. Let's check out Coach.
I'm finding so many contenders at this Coach Outlet store. I think I found a winner, maybe. Okay, love these cream loafers. Too bad they didn't have my size. Check out these beautiful pink and white dragonflies. A perfect picture spot. this boutique. I'm loving the island inspired fashion pieces. This is my husband and I following tip number two. So very important. With these cobblestone streets, you must have comfy shoes. If you're in the mood for gelato, look how cute this place is. I discovered it just walking around. There's also lots of shops where local artists show their pieces. My husband made this reservation for dinner for us at Marmalade. This dining experience did not disappoint. You are provided with five dining courses where all the flavors are paired together perfectly. So you pay one price and you get five courses. Delicious. So sorry guys, my first course was popcorn shrimp, but I ate it too quickly and I didn't film it. That's okay, here's course number two. Marmalade is known for the white bean soup. Amazing, amazing. Everything I ate was so delicious. The texture, the taste, the temperature. A pleasurable experience. Oops, it happened again. I dug in before I filmed. This is an amazing chocolate cake. Thank you so much for coming with me to El Viejo San Juan, Old San Juan. I enjoyed myself. I hadn't been here for about three years. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.